Previously, on Tales from the Borderlands. Yes, I'm learning so much about how you dropped a fake ball key, how you lost ten million dollars, and how. Gee, thanks. I cannot hold back your tide of bad decisions. <laughs> and now. Ooh, nice platform. Haha, <laughs> we made it. Entrance this way. Let's do this. Let's see what else this place has to offer. Um, you okay? <sighs> Anyone else's creepometer going bananas right now? Uh, uh -huh. mine, here. <laughs> you tell him, Vaughn. Unclear. I am unable to translate paralytic grunts. So, my upgrade's nearby. Sorry, it's kind of spooky in here. It's okay. You know, just once, I'd like to search an abandoned health spa or something. With fluffy towels. And celebrity magazines with pictures of them shopping and getting coffee and stuff. Gordis, can you scan the room for, you know, danger? Uh... Could you please describe to me how you think that would work? Well, your sensors kind of like sweep the room's vectors. I mean, that was a totally valiant effort. But no, it doesn't work like that at all. Well, well we thanks for the explanation. Let's, let's look around in here. Can we play hot or cold? Like we did back at the, uh, the um, safe house? Well, I thought I had... There we go. Can we talk to Reese? Find anything? Well, kinda. I mean, this place is Atlas, but it was some kind of terraforming facility. You gathered that from they all the weird plant life plants. outside. I thought all you corporations were just about mass market destruction. Plants can be destructive. I am not a corporation. And see, you learned something today. What about Gordis's upgrade? Is it here? Well, nothing in the files yet, but... A lot of it's been deleted, so that probably says something. And if you don't believe plants can be destructive, let me tell you, um, check out that overgrown vault in the New Vegas wasteland. That thing is some scary business. You find something? I huh? found a desk. Dust. I found dust. Oh, dust. The other D word. There's some clothes here someone's just left lying around. What do you got? Clothes. Looks like someone was wearing this recently. I mean... I don't know how you can tell the recent part. But I will take your word for it. Any luck? No, but Reese found out where we are. Or at least what this place was. Right. Some kind of top secret Atlas biodome. Not much else in the system. Guys... Any sign of the Gordas upgrade? Not yet. We'll keep looking. Guys, keep your eyes open for a wild poly shore. The scariest thing in the wasteland. Ooh, we got a loot crate. Hello. That's a lot of monies. Wait. Why just one? We have added to our bank account. It should have been a lot more than that. There were many more stacks of cash than the one you grabbed. Oh, wait. So is this it? Oh, it's a map. Never mind. I think the technical term for this is highly goddamn suspicious. Yes. What's that? Map. What, what, what kind of map? Unclear. The markings on it seem deliberately obscure. Oh, how fun! Like a treasure hunt map! I was just going to uh, say yeah, that! Yeah, something like that. 
But it doesn't appear to lead to anything, so I doubt it has anything to do with your upgrades. Well, we don't know that for sure yet. Is that in our inventory? Um, apparently not. Okay. That's a little strange. Are you sure your upgrade is around here? I'm positive my energy chassis is here. Somewhere in the general vicinity. Ish. Any idea if of I size? It, it will be glorious. Aw, thank you. I'll just keep looking. Right. Is it big? Is it small? Is it like loader bot sized? Quick change. We can change clothes. We'll do that here in a second. Let's just look at this stuff first. Oh, hello, Athena. What have you got to say? Find anything? Not yet. This place is disconcerting. How so? It's Atlas, and nothing has tried to kill us yet. Hmm. You got a point there, Athena. Nothing here. Plants? Ooh. Was... Bastard? Yeah, that's probably not something you want to mess with. Atlas Extreme Latte 5000. Is it still working? Huh? Why? Atlas might be full of corrupt, murderous bastards, but they made the best lattes. Nope. Ugh. Damn Atlas. I'm surprised you were excited and showed an expression other than disdain for a second there, Athena. Let's, let's try to have more of those moments, shall we? Anyone need some new gear? Any weapons? Nah, no weapons. But there is stuff in here you guys might be interested in. Oh, cool. So we have uh, the base thing. Numerous hidden pockets and high cut to make room for your holster. The Garish Gunslinger was designed for crime without sacrificing fashion. Constructed from rawhide and bullet casings. Oh. So how am I changing between these two? Oh, I guess... Ah, oh, can I like rotate? And I guess they're the same except they're different colors. Uh, inflammability plus or minus 100%. Disclaimer, actual shipped product may not be fire resistant, depending on who you ask, but there is a really cool phoenix on the back. And that's an interesting thing. Flammable and inflammable mean uh, the same thing. Means they're prone to catching a fire. Steampunk Princess. You may not wear socks woven from 24 karat gold thread, but this outfit will make will sure make the unwashed masses think you do. Hmm. Wasteland goggles, that's what you have. Let's see. A modified pair of Bandit's popular Peeping Dom pr protective goggles. These have been enhanced for better looks, UV protection, and slag resistance. Okay. Allows the wearer to appear stylish and fashionable in a variety of electromagnetic spectrums. Okay. Oh, there's stuff here for everyone. The God's Hyperion policy prohibits accountants from leaving their computer stations for any reason. These wearable computing devices were originally hailed as freedom glasses. I mean, these things, there's not a lot of difference in these things, but... See, these sleek spectacles give you a new outlook on life by making you look so darn good. Plus, a bonus reading light. Ooh, there's stuff for Loaderbot, too. Your new zesty yellow friend. Your new friend that murders for you. Scrapped Loaderbot marketing campaign. Alright, wine knowledge plus 1932. 
perfect for black tie events, award ceremonies, and destroying your enemies in the most sartorially approved fashion. Cheers. Rawr. <laughs> Some critics may throw shade and tell you that these eye-catching stripes are tacky, but don't listen to those haters. You are absolutely working it right now. Bonus damage when stalking prey in the night. Fierceness plus 100. Great. For the Hyperion employee looking to get ahead and secure job security, there's no better way to show your commitment than having one of your limbs replaced with this beauty. Hack and slash with the best. Ditch the rest. Great. Fashion ability ice cold. Color combination bonus. I guess it does kind of match the rest of your outfit there, uh, Reese. This sleek black arm with its backlit detailing is guaranteed to turn heads, whether you're at the head of the conference room or the middle of an epic rave. Silver Centurion for the cyborg with discerning taste. The Silver Centurion offers a stylish and attractive option inspired by Atlesian design and architecture. If you're into that kind of thing. Eh... Not really. Cooldown time, 0 0.8 seconds. Style hot. So, I mean, I don't know that buying anything in this game is, like, super necessary or whatever. These are all kind of just fashion accessories. We've only got so much money may that may be useful eventually, I suppose. So, I guess I'll just leave things as they are. That's cool, though. So we've got the quick change. I didn't really see anything else we could interact with. There's a door there. I guess that's the way we came in. Can we go back up here? We can. I mean, it looks like we took the map, but we don't really have... Oh, hello. What do you see? Anything? I mean, I don't see anything. There are these tubey things. Okay. Well, that map's still not in our inventory. There's the gift box, though. Can we do anything with it? No. All right. Still got the general's eyeball there as well, it looked like. Another map or readout thing up there. Do we need to use the fashion thing? Because I am absolutely not seeing anything else we can do. Huh. Can't talk to anyone either. Well, maybe if we buy one of these things, it'll give us... Oh, there's fruit. I miss that. Fresh fruit. In here? I don't know Find about something? fresh. And yeah, drake fruit stash. Like actual drake fruit? Can I have some of it? Someone took a bite out of the only fresh piece. So sure, if you want cooties. This is weird. I think someone's been living here. I mean, that's what it looks like. Don't worry so much. Maybe he'll be nice. Or she. Could always be a she. Could. Oops. Oops, what? Where'd Loaderbot go? What's going on? Um... What's up, Gordas? Why'd you go oops and hide inside your shell? Gordas? Gordas! Don't kill me! Where did you come from? Please, please don't kill me. I, I, I have just been watching you. Just, just watching, that's all. I swear, I am completely harmless. I'll take your word for that, I there guess. There is absolutely Not. no need for you to kill me. I, I assure you. We're not here to hurt you. You do realize that the more you tell us not to kill you, the more it seems like it's kind of the right idea. Everything's okay. If you're not here to hurt us, we're not here to hurt you. Thank you for that. 
You remind it me of Felix. It is genuinely rare to encounter reasonable, somewhat intelligent-seeming people. With the glasses and outfit and things. Hey there! That little robot's why we're here. There's an upgrade somewhere nearby. We're looking for it. Well, I, I, I can't help you with that. I know nothing about it. So, you should leave. We all should leave, all of us, going our separate ways. Oh, I totally I can buy that. Right now, in fact, and if anyone asks, not that anyone would, of course, but I, I'll tell them, I'll say, I didn't see you. All right, two things. You're A, really weird, and B, obviously hiding something. What is it? I, I just, I, I, um, oh, uh, your, your friend there. Does he happen to suffer from artificially induced hemispherical abdomition? Um, is that paralysis? Paralysis? Yes. Yeah, that's a good question, Vaughn. Why didn't you just say paralysis? Because he's not technically paralyzed. Uh, the contortion, the blinkless eyes, all signs of a toxin called thanatopsol. Then wait, 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 you've seen this before? Yes. If you let me get a better look at him. So you can fix him? <laughs> Though I do feel like him? you're changing the of subject. Of course you can, right? You're a doctor. We have no idea if he's a doctor. Let's just assume that he is. Help me get your friend on the table. And even if he yeah, is distracting right. us and things, I want Vaughn to be better again. Well, here we are. What is that? Actually, young lady, I could use your help. Would okay. you take this, please? Um, that's a massive syringe. Uh, yeah. Okay. Glad I'm not the one what getting that stuck in me. You're plunging it into his heart. What? Okay, well, I mean, I'm here we go. Great. At least it's letting me use the WASD keys so, and stuff for directions down instead of the arrow keys. I don't I do know. like that. I hadn't even noticed it. I've never done anything like this before. Uh, what? I thought you knew. <laughs> Someone please spit in my eye or lick, lick my eye. I don't care. Oh lick God, me in the, eye. the toxin turned him insane. <laughs> or into an eyeball fetishist. He's dehydrated, but the shot you gave him should help. Oh, 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 man. Oh, that's the stuff. Oh, <laughs> Thank you for blinking. Oh, God. Well, oh. glad I could help. Well, hang on there, Doc. If that is your real name. It's not, and I never said it was. Well, I'm not done with you yet. <laughs> there's no need for you to be this suspicious, surely. Um, I, I just I mean, there's lots you. of need. <sighs> Very well. I'm on the run, you see. I have lost everything. My wife. My son. My cat. I did not lose them in that order, though. I, I lost my wife first, then my cat, then my son. So, wife, cat, son. Uh-huh. You ever thought of becoming a professional storyteller? Because I gotta tell you, your sense for crucial information is just... Reese. Forgive me. It's been a long time since I've enjoyed human contact. Uh, perhaps I've forgotten how to talk to people. You must understand, I've suffered months of wandering, isolation, skulking from one location to the next, broken, ashamed, homeless. I got here to this place only minutes ago, so... I'd ask that you leave me now. You're clearly lying. And go. You've been here for a long time, otherwise you wouldn't have known where that syringe was. That's a sad story, but I still don't trust him. Me neither. I do. Is that dumb of me? I saw your map, which I assume you made while exploring this facility. I have no idea what you're talking about. Oh, no? So maybe you won't mind if I... No! Don't do that! To that uh, is map, is it? Uh, that I've never seen before? Just fond of paper. <laughs> what is your like deal, dude? Man. You've probably figured out by now that the easiest way to end all this and get rid of us is simply tell the truth. 
I hope he Proposal remembers it. Proposal accepted, young lady. I'll tell you what you want to know. Follow me. Why do I still doubt that? I and am not trust not you a in the least. Traveler. I have lived here for months. So, dead wife, dead kid, that's all horse crap. Yes. The bunker within that jungle. I suspect it contains the upgrade you're looking for. I wish I could tell you more about what's inside, but I was never brave enough to check. The problem, your problem, is the Atlas automated security system that surrounds said bunker. Isn't it always? If I were you, and in this instance I'm relieved I am not, I'd gain access to the security tower, which is... There. <laughs> I can get in and disable the security systems. Easy. Not easy. Not at all easy. But your best option, nonetheless. Automated security system, huh? Huh. Just realized the acronym for that is ASS! Ha! <laughs> yeah, that's probably why no one calls it that. <laughs> hey, Reese. Guess what we're gonna do? We're gonna disable Atlas's ASS. <laughs> So good. You sure you've never been inside? Can we re paralyze sure? Vaughn? No more lies, as we agreed. Reese, think you can. Why do I not believe you at all? Please, in my sleep. So we're done talking then? We can actually go secure this upgrade now? Fiona, while Mr. Robot Eye here hits the security tower and hacks the defenses, you and I will infiltrate the bunker and grab the upgrade. Let's get this gorgeous piece and get out of here, huh? Um... Oh, uh... You and I? Yeah, let's work together on this one. Okay, little update from me, uh, which is... I feel terrible! Not good at all. And I'm sure I've got some residual nerve damage. Do you want the thing oh, pulled out of your chest? You right, thank you for that input. So, I'm gonna maybe chill out here? That's cool with everyone? Uh, yeah. That's okay. I'll go with Reese. Okay. There's a lot of stuff I can do, right? Huh? I mean, I don't have a robot eye. I'm not a highly trained assassin. Also not particularly charming, but but I can still do stuff. Listen. Yeah, I, 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 just I get some rest. I'll, I'll figure out something to do back here while you're gone. Have fun, everyone. Being awesome, I guess. You know, Vaughn, you've been through a lot. Maybe for now you should just focus on getting some rest. Rest? <laughs> Rest sounds nice, actually. Thanks, Fiona. You're welcome. Also, don't let that old guy kill you or do weird experiments right. on you, okay? Everyone knows what they're doing? Yeah. Uh -huh. yep. And with a plan like this, what could possibly go wrong? You had to say it, didn't you? You just had to say it.